this wouldn't be a Shaquille O'Neal appearance if we also didn't do Mama, a quick round Mama, I'm a good, yeah. of the greatest show, uh, the greatest game we've ever created for any show. Ever. Black crime. White crime. Or white crime. <laughs> so, Rob, this is so you got this, some WFS going on? This is how this works. I'm going to give you a ridiculous <laughs> news story. You just have to tell me, was it a white guy or was it a black guy? Uh, okay. All right. So here we go. Story number one. Two teenage brothers from New Jersey are charged with homicide after the cops stumbled onto them trying to dispose of a dead body in the woods. How did they find them? They left their flashers on when they pulled the car over to dispose of the body. That's some white white folks shit right there. Okay. Rob saying white folks, Jack (laughs) saying black folks. What do you think, Harper? I'm going to say black. All right. This is a... Anthony and Joshua Gamble, both white guys. Both oh, white guys. So, first of all, brothers yeah. don't fucking use flashes, so that's why. Like, oh yeah, oh yeah. Follow the clues. Follow the clues, Rob. All right. Story number two: A woman was busted for a home invasion in Oklahoma after she broke into a home and had a snack, and she left an empty chip bag and a bottle of water by the window. How did they catch her? The chips that she left were Cheetos. And oh, cops bust her with Cheetos in her teeth and Cheetos under her fingers. Black. White. White. That's Oklahoma. Ain't no black folks in Oklahoma. That's, exactly. that's a plan for the Sooners. Uh, <laughs> this, was, uh, this was Sharon Carr, a black woman. Oh. 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 Wait a minute. Number one, I know it's Oklahoma. But she don't, black folk love Cheetos. Yeah. And, she, and she didn't lick her finger, so she still had the Cheeto residue underneath her nails. See, so that's yeah, why, that's see, that's why I thought it was someone white, because, you know, black folks... <laughs> we got to get that in. <laughs> All right, story three. A man who eluded police for months after escaping from jail in November got caught sneaking out during mandatory pandemic lockdowns. Why did he sneak out? Why did he risk it? He wanted to buy the new Call of Duty game. Cops spotted him and arrested him immediately. So guy who snuck out of quarantine and got caught, black or white? Black. Oh, that's black. That's black guy. Because they love the video games, especially Call of Duty yeah, and 2K. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and Mad, those three games right there, oh, they got to get it in. That was definitely Jermaine. <laughs> oh, no. Actually, that was Clint Butler, a white guy. No. Nice. Yeah, white guy. I'm losing it. Losing your I'm touch, losing it. It's been too long. Yeah. Story you four. Don't have answers no more. We got a couple more here. Uh, oh, I heard that. <laughs> oh. <laughs> No. All right, here you go. A couple more here. A Florida man is in custody for allegedly trying to throw a live alligator off of the roof of a building. He had stolen it from a nearby enclosure, and when asked boy, by boy. police what he was doing, he said, quote, I'm teaching it a lesson. <laughs> he was uh, arrested. Yeah. WFS, that's some white folk shit right there, because brothers, oh, yeah. <laughs> everybody, <laughs> no hey, we only going to Papa Do's to eat alligator. We ain't fucking with alligator <laughs> like right. that. That's a uh, William Hodge, a thirty-two-year-old white guy. Yeah. 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 Okay, we, we, we not even touching alligator, let alone throwing one off the roof. <laughs> All right, story five: two would-be thieves probably thought they had the perfect plan. One of them was going to go into Kohl's, a department store, rob it, run out the back, and hop into the getaway car. The problem is, is his buddy outside let the battery die on the getaway car, so they both got arrested. Oh, yeah, white black guys, guys or black, black guys? Black. Black. That's black, black folks. Yeah, they're, uh, they're both black guys. Good job. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, black yeah, black black. All right, two more and we're done. Uh, guards usually don't have to watch for people breaking into jail, so they didn't notice this man climbing over two fences and scrambling to a second-floor door. He said he was trying to evade a man with a gun chasing him, so he broke into prison. He was pleaded. He pleaded not guilty, but he got hit with some misdemeanor charges. So did the guy that broke into prison? White guy. Black guy would have rather got shot. (laughs) I gotta go. That's white guy. Yeah, that's that's yeah, that's white guy. Oh, once again, Moises Robles, thirty-five-year-old black guy. Yeah. No, no, no. no. All right, last last one. Last one. Uh, a man who robbed a bank wearing a pillowcase without eye holes was easily arrested after fleeing. Oh, white oh. guy, Klu Klux Klan, white guy. <laughs> white guy, Klu Klux Klan. He said the KKK. Uh, yeah. uh, Matthew Davies, a white guy. Yeah, there's a... Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah. All right. yeah, yeah. absolutely. Yeah. One of our all-time favorite games. Oh, I, I, can't, I, can't, I can't think of that many black guys that have robbed banks. Uh, so every time hey, I look up, you know, 